recently, we built a wall riding tank and built about 10 feet every other tank ever made. But then all of a sudden, I recall a picture sent to me by my friend Jaden of him standing on the flagpole upside down. Now, guys, this is possible. You know, like you can probably just kind of glue yourself up there to the top. But then all of a sudden, he also sent me this picture right here. Uh, and that's when I knew that his, this man has figured out something pretty interesting. He figured out a way to walk on walls. And guys, today, I want to try to figure out my own. Guys, he sent me this like the 25th of August. It's right now a lot, a lot later. But I, I, he's come up with a video of how to build it. But guys, I want to try out my very own methods, okay? This is going to be a challenge for me. I'm going to figure out if I have the skills to be able to finally, for once, walk on walls. It's going to be pretty interesting. So guys, I have a bit of an idea on where to start. Um, So right here, if I actually load in my tank, I can do a very quick proof of concept, guys. This is the tank we built in the last video. As you can see, here it is. It's very pretty. Now, I'm actually going to make everything visible real quick just so that i can see what's happening so right here we have these like wall attachment uh units right there let's call them that it's kind of just like a random name i just came up with but what happens if i just attach those to my body what if you attach wall writing units to your body i mean i don't know what happens that's what we're gonna figure out right now all right let's see the moment of truth is this the solution i have a feeling that this is not gonna be the solution because otherwise um it would have been pretty easy solution <laughs> all right so here we are we have the units under there under the floor and and let's see what happens if I just activate these real quick. Boom. Ah! 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 That is, guys, not the solution. <laughs> Okay, guys, I used three wall riding units there. Let me try only doing one, okay? <laughs> okay, maybe three was a little bit overkill. All right, let's do this one more time, but it's time with, with a little bit less force. All right, turn one. There you go. There's one. All right, guys, so here we are. Let's activate it. Ah! Okay, yeah, that is not going to be the solution. That doesn't work very well. Oh, my God, dude. This is, this is a disaster. Okay, we're going to have to do some funky stuff. <laughs> All right, so um, how can I make it look like I'm standing when I'm really not standing? Because I'm pretty sure the only way we can actually do something like this is by actually doing it. That sounds kind of silly, but you say it. Uh, by, by actually doing it like in a, in, a, in a seat, like how we've done it before. Kind of like this. Like imagine if it had all of this fancy stuff removed and we just rode like a little car, but not make it look like we're riding a little car. Because when you sit down in something, you look like an idiot. Look at me. I look stupid as heck now. Like you can clearly see from the images that my man didn't look like he was, you know, sitting down or anything. <laughs> What if I make my bot my body forced to, to look a certain way? Here, let's do this. So if you do, I think if you go like one block up and then place a sidewards one of these and place a cake inside of your body, you can do this little trick that actually lets you straighten out your body just like this. There you go. Look, I'm perfectly straight now. Looks like I'm just standing. Now, what if I glue my entire body shut? <laughs> Make everything just one big glob of goo. All right, let's see. What what happens if this entire thing is all goop? All right, we're completely made up from goop right now. All right, so here we are. Okay, so if I actually hide all this. Hello, guys. I am Goop Man. All right, so far, so good. So this is part one of how I would do this. When I'm walking, I kind of look like I'm fly glitching, actually. I am fly glitch man. All right, here. Let's see what happens when I sit down in a chair. Because I remember some funky stuff with chairs and butter glue people. But I don't know if I... I don't know if this will work. Can I sit in this chair, please? Hello. Oh, oh wait. I'm sitting in the chair and I'm... Oh, yeah, baby. I think... I think I figured out the solution here. So, guys, as you can see, I'm currently sitting in this chair. And it looks like I'm completely standing. So, when I unanchor this... Look, if I... Currently, I don't have anything attached to me. But what if I had, like, some kind of way of maneuvering around? Like... Um, Okay, this is gonna look really dumb. Okay, I can't really do much with this. I kind of messed it all up. Okay, launch the water. There you go. As you guys can see, no matter what happens now, I'm actually standing. I am forced to stand up right now, which is pretty good. I think we can actually manage to figure this out, guys. This has been so fun. Like, this is kind of like a little puzzle that, uh, that you want to figure out, guys. I love finding builds that are super dope and creative and trying to find my own way of achieving the same effect. I don't know if this is how he did it. He probably found a, an easier way to do it since he's an absolute genius. But regardless, this is a lot of fun. All right, so let's do what I think we got to do next up. So let's start off by building our creation here. So we're going to have to go up a little bit just so that way, you know, <laughs> we're not building on the floor. Because we got to go build our, you know, what do you call 
call it? Like wall riding unit? Now, guys, one thing that is very apparent to me is the fact that the way he... If we build a car right now, right? Like, let's say I go build a car. The minimum footprint a car can possibly be is something like this. Like, set it to 0 0.2. And then, like, yeah, guys, this is the absolute smallest you can make a car. Like that. And then with movement two, placing one in there. That is the absolute smallest you can make it. And then you got to both... Wait, no, you can't even do that because then you can't turn anymore. It's like something like this. Yeah. Like, that's the most narrow it can be. Which isn't quite narrow enough to go up there. Hmm. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Ah! Discovery! Look right there. You can see the magnet underneath of him. There it is right there. That is such a huge discovery. Oh my God. I never even seen that before. All right. You know what, guys? I'm going to start off with my very first proof of concept here. So let's just bloody do this, right? Okay. So we have a little platform right here. And right here, we're going to make the smallest possible car that I can kind of come up with. So something like that, that with a wheel glitched inside of there, just like so. And we're going to do the same on the back wheels, just like that. I think this is like literally the smallest you can make a stable car. Now, we're going to have to attach these with as light of a block as possible. So, I'm going to use plastic. And then the chair is going to go right here, right? Yeah, okay. Chair right there. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I remember the... Okay, wait, wait, wait. I actually have a really good idea right here. What I can do real quick is I can actually do a little something like this. Do the glitch from earlier. All right, there we go. All right, there we go. We, we can do it with only four blocks, which makes this actually a lot better. Like, I want it to look like I'm really standing on stuff. So, I want to figure out the right distance from my feet that I want to put this thing. So, oh, wait. Oh, that's so annoying. You can't select multiple butter blocks because it will, uh, like, activate them. And boom. Okay, there we go. So, yeah, we have the glitch right now where we're just looking like we're standing. Let's sit in here and let's see where our feet end up. Yeah, we got to go 0 0.5 blocks thick. So, that's how high the floor will be. Oh, my God. We're going to have to go really low down. Something like that? I think that's where the chair needs to go. Even lower. Oh, my God. All right now, we're actually in the floor. Great. <laughs> Too low. All right. I think there it is, guys. It looks like we're now just standing here, which is exactly what we want to see. So right here needs to go the chair, no matter what. Actually, I can delete all these butter blocks now. Yay, I'm a normal human again. All right, boom. There it is. There goes the chair. <laughs> The chair's kind of glitched inside there a little bit. That, that should be fine. That should be fine. All right, next up, let's build the actual mechanic for the magnet. And a lot of people don't really know how to build this. Pretty easy, guys. I'm just going to make a little platform right here just so that way we're not building on the chair itself. Oh, oops. Uh, 0 0.5. 0 0.5. Boom. There it is. So all we got to do, guys, very simple. You just place a magnet underneath any vehicle, just like so. And then all you got to do, guys, is very, very easy. You go right here. You grab yourself a hinge. Where is this a hinge? Hinge. Place it right there in between, like, the, the two things. And then all you got left to do is to place a block right here. The heavier the block, guys, the more force it pulls towards the ground. So you want to kind of find the right block for your build, but for anything really light, uh, wood is just fine. All right, guys, I think we're ready to try this out. So let's see, baby. Walking on walls. I'm just going to do this just like this for now, just to test it out. Wait, I got to actually collision off, collision off, collision off, and collision off. Okay, here, unanchor this baby and let's see. I'm not going to do the actual like proper... Oh my God, I placed the chair wrong, didn't I? Okay, wait, that's fine. Okay, I can just still test. Activate that. Okay. Okay, so let's see. Can I go on the walls? Oh, why, why am I not going on walls? What have I done wrong here? I think I need more force pulled. Let me replace this block with a little bit heavier, like, um, metal. Oh, okay, wait, that was way too much force. Okay, wait, wait, maybe we're good. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. <laughs> Okay, if only I didn't place my chair the wrong way. God damn it. Okay, okay, wait. So we're, we're definitely glitching out a little bit. I think, yeah, I think the force is just way too strong right now. All right, let's see. If I had this at a 45 angle, can I ride up this wall? Do we have enough pulling force? Oh, we do. Oh, oh, but we're going really slow. Oh my God. Yeah, guys, I think it's safe to say that right now we've actually kind of built something a little bit wrong. Okay, I'm gonna have to make a couple small fixes here and it shouldn't be too bad. So one of the first things I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spread out the wheels a little bit. I feel like the way the wheels are right now, they're a little little bit prone to breaking. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to stretch this out a little bit. So just a little something like that should do. Boom. There you go. So that way everything is a little bit more spread out. Mm, what is just heavier than wood? Maybe like, I guess like maybe sand. Let's try sand. Sand should do maybe actually. All right, there you go. Let's see how this is going to do. Activate. Okay, so we're driving. We're driving just fine. Go on the wall. Wait, didn't we? Wait, I think the problem is the torque. Oh, it's the wheel torque. I'm an idiot. Ah! Every time I forget that you got to change the wheel torque. Don't worry about it, guys. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be able to just use wood. I have a really light build here. Yeah, you need to have that torque to able to be able to actually like get up something. Here, so I'm actually going to go back a slot. All right, slightly better torque and slightly lower wheel speed. Okay, that should do just fine. <laughs> 
All right, let's see. Activate. All right, we're able to drive now just fine. I still have the chair backwards, but yeah. We're now able to go on walls like we won to two, which is perfect. All right, let me fix some final things here. And let's put everything together. And I think we might have ourselves right here a wall riding character glitch. Dude, this is sick. Okay, so rotate the chair. Boom, just like that. Gotta make some stuff invisible. That's fine. Actually, everything needs to be invisible. I don't need to make any specific thing invisible. <laughs> All right, now let's make a little bit of a glue station. So let's go three chairs up and then rotate like that. And that should be perfect. We're going vertical. All right, yeah, here. Oh, yeah, perfect. Okay, dope. So let's save it right here. Let's go, baby. Dude, we got this. Let's go. Wait, actually, I'm going to make one little addition here. I think I might, with this addition, be able to actually ride on the flagpole. Okay, so right there is right in front of the wheel. I'm going to make a little bit of a guard right here. To kind of like almost like right on the floor with us. All right, there it is. Perfect. That looks really good. I'm going to have to do that on both sides. There it is. Okay, so with that, I think I might be able to walk onto the flagpole just because, guys, if you look right there, actually, I might have to crank this up just like 0.1 just so that way it doesn't like collide with anything. Um, but like, so that way the wheels are actually on the floor and stuff. Um, but I think with that, we might be able to grind on the, uh, the, the flagpole right there just because like this will actually like have collision on and stuff. I don't know. It makes sense when you see it, okay? All right, let's save. All right, baby, the moment of truth. Let's go. A little bit of a star like that. Just like so. Everything is unanchored. Everything needs to be invisible. Okay, so like all I need to find the chair real quick let's go in the chair and here we are baby actually did i do this right okay yeah, we're facing the right way now for once okay awesome and let's see are we riding on the walls all right baby let's go here we go a moment of truth okay we are no longer able to ride on the walls i think it's because of the okay let's get rid of that okay wait i can't really see what is happening right now something is going wrong oh wait it's this damn it okay that that was a bad idea guys that was a bad idea let's go oh we're riding on the walls look at us walking on wall la mao dude this is so cool dude, we can even go like up the tree and stuff dude this is so trippy looking oh my god dude okay look we're going down <laughs> dude this is crazy dude now guys for the ultimate challenge i've been i've been looking forward to this mom please please work please work please work ah! Wait, 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 wait. We're doing it. We're doing it. Whoa, wait, no, 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 no. Oh, my God, bro. Oh, I almost had it. I almost bloody had it, dude. Come on, come on. Go. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, we're standing on the flagpole now, but it's not quite right. Ah, oh, yeah, man. We can't do it. We can stand on trees, though. It's kind of cool. Okay, and now we're flying. Come on, please put me back on the floor. I don't want to be here. Guys. Come on. This is not funny. Stop pranking me. Dude, this is actually so sick. Now, I think because my friend Jay actually did a much better job of building his design, he could probably walk on walls because of that. But hey, I, I'm still really happy with the way this thing is turning out. But hey, I'm still really happy with the way this thing has turned out. All right, so yeah, this, that needs to go. That is just garbage. <laughs> All right, let's unanchor everything. And let's get some of you guys in here. And let's confuse the living crap out of you all. So this is what it looks like without any of the invisible, which is kind of strange. <laughs> People are joining, and I need to make this thing invisible real quick. Ah, uh, there you go. Whoa, just in time. So guys, as you can see, we're currently slightly off the ground, but that's that's for a good reason, okay? Although if we were on the ground, we'd be scraping all the time, and it would just be like really hard to actually move around and stuff. Now, because we're actually human, I'm going to set the wheel speed to about like human walking speed, okay? Just so that way it doesn't look quite as sus. And I think with this, we can still ride on the walls. Okay, wait, I think I have to up the torque even more than let's make it yellow yeah, yeah okay yellow is perfect yellow is perfect hi all right baby let's get on this wall what the heck did you do this time jesse <laughs> wait wait i need more speed i need more speed wait a minute i clicked invisible on accident wait i need the wheel speed to be 30 okay i revealed it to like one guy over there i mean it's fine it's it's not the end of the world okay, getting down things is a little bit bad i gotta give a lot of speed to get down things but hey it's fine but look at us going right now man look at us go hi Whoosh. Zoom, 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 zoom. All right, baby, let's go. Let's go up this wall. And you know what? I feel like going to the end. How about, how about that? I feel like just walking along the walls, going to the end. Oh my God. Please don't fling me off. Please don't fling me off. Please don't. Look, dude, this thing is God tier, man. Look at us going, baby. Now, I think I am the only man that has ever made his way to the end just like this. <laughs> has there been anyone else? If you've done this before, you're a weirdo, okay? Look at us going, man. This is so sick. And whoosh. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, wait, we gotta go. Oh, wait, we don't have enough space right here. Okay, wait, that's fine. I'll just go like this. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, we're on the inside now. We're on the inside of the stages. Oh jeez, oh god. We gotta run. We gotta run. We gotta go quick. Oh jeez. Oh, oh my god. Ah, the notes are coming. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, just get me up here or something. I mean, I don't know. Get me out of here, man. I don't want to be here right now. <laughs> 
I want to be on the outside. The outside is so much safer. No, I glitched out. Oh, God. Wait, wait. We might be able to make it to the end. We didn't make it to the end, guys. Guys, but with that, I'm going to be ending off today's video, guys. If you want to know how to build yourself one of these things absolutely perfectly so that you can maybe even stand on, like, the flagpole and stuff, go check out my friend Jay's video. He's made a video about it already and how you can do all of this stuff, okay? So, yeah, I'll leave that link down in the description. But, guys, I'll see you on the next one, boys. Peace out, everyone. And bye-bye. <laughs> this was a lot of fun. This was dope.